Hey, be a squid and subscribe to my mediocrity. Oh my god, here we go again, boys. So before we get started, let me say that this video might be a bit lengthy because I'm going to answer questions right now so that way you don't have to message me on Discord. So the first question that I'm going to answer is, why does it sound bad? Now bad is sort of a blanket term that can be like listed under various things where it's like, oh, I have a bad microphone or I'm not performing like I always say you have to do. So we'll cover those things really quick. First thing is going to be hardware. If you don't have a somewhat decent microphone with a little bit of hardware in there, it's going to sound bad. I've actually had people that have messaged me that are using literal earbuds and it's like, bruh, what were you expecting when you walked out with Walmart fucking earbuds and you're like, why does it sound bad? Because you didn't put any money forward. You don't have to put a whole lot of money, but you're going to have to do better than that. Now, I am just using a $30 USB Amazon microphone. That is it. It's nothing insane. It's nothing crazy, but it is a bit more expensive than your $10 earbuds. So keep that in mind. If you're using a headset or earbuds, you may have results that may vary. And that is nothing that like there's nothing I can do to help you because I don't use that. So I can't like tell you, oh, just turn the settings to this. I, I don't know. I don't use that. Which brings me to my next point, which is going to be settings. Now, voice mod has a variety of settings and 90% of the time is going to be tailored to your voice as well as your hardware. So let's say you have a microphone that is better than me or worse than me. I don't know. Either which way, you're going to have to still tailor it to that microphone as well as your voice. So if you have a deep voice where like, Oh, you talk like this or whatever, where you sound a lot more lower. It's like, I don't know, I'm just fucking being stupid, but you get the point. If you talk lower or you have a more low pitch voice, you're going to have to sort of change that because my settings that I have may not work for you. Everybody's voice is different. There's not much I can do to help. You. The next part of that question is basically performance. If it sounds bad, there's a good chance you're not performing very well. Now, I have a variety of voices here. Every single one of these requires some percentage of performance. Blitzcrank, about 10% performance. Ergot, about 60% performance. Scion, I'd say about 80%. Rek'Sai, 90% performance because you literally have to become an alien that speaks an alien language and snarls and growls. So like actually you have to do a little bit of something you can't just flip a switch and then just be like oh hey it's me i'm fucking ergot i'm blitzcrank like it doesn't work you, you can't just do that hey guys it's me ergot oh my god i think you recognize me do i sound like ergot oh dude, this performance is flawless this is the thing that annoys me the most because people just think you can flip a switch and just be like oh hey i'm ergot it works it it, it doesn't it, same thing goes for a girl voice you have to do a little bit of something. You can't just be like, Hey, I'm a girl. What's up? Do you believe me? Um, you have to put a little bit of performance. You feel me? See, if you put a little bit of effort, you get a much better result. And that's the point I want to make to you, is that if you don't try, you're going to get fucking garbage, you piece of shit. Yes, that is the girl voice. I will explain why it sounds the way it does, but... For the most part, if you want a believable performance, you better fucking perform. Next question that I'm going to answer with example is, why does it sound robotic? All right, so before I show an example, let me explain how voice mod works. So I think of this program as like an audio, uh, you know, like engineering program, but it's done in real time. So things like what Adobe Audition, I think is what it is. That's like a vocal editing program. So you have a voice actor or whatever, and you have them do their performance naturally and then it gets sent to an audio engineer that uses an engineering program for audio and then once that's done it the final product is put into you know effect now 90 percent of voice actors that are doing natural voices which for the girl voice i would classify that as a natural voice it's you know it's grounded in reality it's not something like ergot where you're like this cyborg crab man with fucking shotgun knees it's, it's grounded in reality. So whenever you have a natural performance, you don't edit much. There's not a lot of post-processing done. There's probably just, you know, things to fix uh, audio peaks and maybe pitch up and down slightly if they're going for a more, 
you know, uh, I, I don't know about what the word is here, but if they're just trying to adjust the voice, they, they do it minutely and it's very subtle. Voice mod, on the other hand, does not excel in creating a natural voice. And I'm going to show you how and why that is. So if you take pitch, right? I am pitched up. I sound like I probably sucked like 40 fucking helium balloons. And this is the result. You can hear that it does not sound natural whatsoever. And there's nothing about this. I'm just talking in my normal voice. Like I'm not even like performing nothing. I'm just talking as I would normally. Um, but like if I do a little bit of a performance, it's slightly more believable, but it's not like um, perfect. You can hear the sort of girly tone, but you still hear that robotic sounding side of voice mod. And that's, um, the problem. It doesn't work. So for those of you wondering why it sounds robotic, it's because voice mod is not meant for a natural sounding voice. So just as a heads up, if you want something natural, you're not gonna get that ever but if you want a more natural performance when it comes to doing a girl voice you can use something like clownfish which i've already made a video on way way back in the day and that video still holds true to today all you got to do is pitch up slightly in your natural voice and then pitch up in the program and find the sweet spot and there you go i'll put a link in the description or a top comment or pin comment whatever you want to call it and you guys can go check that video out but for the most part when it comes to voice mod, you're not going to get a natural performance, but you can get a decent performance in terms of adding a little bit of flair to a girl. So I have this voice here, fucking kill me, and this is the girl voice. So this is the girl, lolly, whatever you want to call it voice, okay? And I, I, I classify that, I'll, we'll just say this is the Paimon voice because that's what it reminds me of whenever I use this shitty ass voice. And it essentially is just an a, like a reverbed, um, you know, girl voice. And the reason we oversaturated it with reverb was because it was more believable and it hides the robot sounding side of things. Now with this voice, it all comes down to performance. You can't talk naturally with this voice. It doesn't work. So the way I use this voice is I talk in a quieter tone and I sort of pitch upwards. So think of whispering and then um, talking in a higher tone. That's pretty much how this voice works. Um, as you guys can hear, it sounds a lot more believable, and it's like, um, Paimon. So, I mean, as long as you're performing, you can actually hear the voice and it sounds somewhat believable. But, like, um, if you're not performing, it sounds more like Now, to give an example as to how I'm talking without the voice is essentially I'm talking like this. I'm just talking like this in a more natural voice, I'm trying to be a little bit more energetic, and I'm trying to kind of be more out there in line with Paimon. That is literally how I talk whenever I do this fucking voice. That's pretty much it. There's nothing special about it. Just whisper, high pitch. That's it. Settings are on the screen right now, but that should answer all the questions. Why does it sound bad? You have horrible hardware or you have a horrible performance. Why does it sound robotic? It's because voice mod is not meant to recreate realistic voices. Nothing you can do about it. If you want to do a girl voice, you better come up with a scenario where it makes sense because trying to do a natural girl voice in voice mod is not possible. But when you're trying to do something like Paimon or a more like, you know, a deity voice in terms of a girl or something, or I don't know, just anything, you can add a little bit of flair to it via that. Maybe you want to do an Oriana voice, for example. You could do a robot effect on this and then talk in a girl voice, and there you go, you have Oriana. Never experimented with that, but it's something that is doable within voice mod because you can do a girl performance, pitch upwards, and add a robot effect, and it can work. So anyway, that is the video. I'm sorry it took so long, but this is the best I can do with voice mod currently. There's nothing else I can do. Hopefully this answered all your questions and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.